2017, in the month of April, I lost my other rustler, and I actually do miss it. But now, months later, we are now closing the year of 2017. It is almost the end of the year. And now, just in time before Christmas, or in this case, before December, she's back. She's back. Tracks as Rustler. She is back. Yeah, I'm sorry. Poor quality today, but uh, that's not doesn't really matter anymore at all to me. Because what matters most is what you see right now. It's this Rustler. I'm happy that I got it back. Um, well, this is not the original Rustler that I had. This is just a roller that I bought at, at OfferUp. But anyways, let me take out the body. And everything you see here. All the electronics, my motor, ESC, receiver, and yes, I don't have a receiver box for it, so I just tape dirt tracks underneath it. And the servo that you don't see here are from my slash. That's right, I gutted some parts out of the slash to make this uh, to make this a complete RC. Why did I do that? Because the guy that originally sold it then had then had a uh, radius receiver, radio transmitter, no electronics, none of that, not even the wheels. It's all straight up chassis and front and rear parts. But all in all, we still got our work. We still got a worker here. The only problem is, is the battery tray. This can only hold up to six cell or seven cell hump packs, and I and my seven cells are straight packs. And this is why I can only fit as of right now. Some over there at the hobby community will say there's a wall over here that you will not see that you should take that out using a Dremel. I don't have a Dremel. And yes, my XL5 ESC is just hanging around there. I don't have a, uh, a plate for it. I'll buy one soon. But anyways, there she is. And yes, I'm running slash rims. Like I said, I don't have the... I don't have the original Rustler tires to go with it. I'm planning to put Anacondas, the same setup as my original Rustler, and yeah. So, um, I, I do recall, if I do recall, these are not the original shocks, if I'm not mistaken. But anyways, um, there she is, Rustler is back, and uh, my, or my original Rustler was lowered, this one is not. And yes, that is right forward. I need to fix that soon. But, uh, yeah, she's she's back. I'm going to be doing some more running videos with it. And eventually give it a Doug score for the Doug score RC edition. And uh, in the end screen, in the end screen on this video, you will see a playlist of RC hobby grade videos. In those videos, you will see um, a few number of my original Rustler runs and running videos and stuff like that. So feel free to take a look at those. But anyways, she's back. Traxxas Rustler is back. And also the reason why um, I'm going to be using this as my runner as of this year, as, as the remainder of this year, is because I give in my slash a lot of uh, chances to drive around. Now it's time for something new. And uh, plus, I'm actually going to bring this to San Francisco with me, and it actually fits in my backpack over there. So, yeah. Well, that is it, guys. Just giving you guys a little update on the Traxxas Wrestler. Bye bye.